Hi everybody. While everybody's hating on Comcast, I thought I'd throw my two cents in. I called Comcast uh, about four weeks ago because I thought I was paying too much, $120 a month. Now I like my high speed internet and uh, I want to keep that. The TV I never watch. I just think it's a lot of crap. Anyway, so I call up Comcast. I talked to a guy who really can't help me, so he gets me with his supervisor. It sounded like a black lady. I could be wrong. And talked with her, and she was evasive and didn't really want to help a lot, it seemed like. And she picked up on the fact that maybe I was a little perturbed, though I did not push her. Um, finally, I said, look, I just want to save some money on my TV. What can you do? Is there anything you can do? I just want internet. I want to pay as little for TV as possible. So she says, she says, well, hold on a minute. Comes back and says, okay, I saved you $10 on your bill. Stupid me, I didn't ask about it. And I said, well, thank you very much. And she goes, well, you're welcome. Is there anything else I can do for you? I said, no. So I hang up. About four hours later, I go to download something and find my internet speed is like cut in half. Cut in half. So I call Comcast up. And I say, what's up with my internet speed? Why is it not working like it should? And they said, well, you called a few hours ago and had your internet speed downgraded. And I thought, what? This lady, in good faith, told me she saved me $10 when I told her specifically I wanted my internet the same. It was TV. And this kind of smart ass stuff really aggravated me. I can understand. Comcast is a monopoly now. Just like in Mexico, the richest man in the world owns all the cell phones down there. I wish somebody would come along with a fiber optic network or something so we can just have our internet. Nobody wants that crappy TV stuff. But Comcast forces us to have TV with our internet. And I don't think they're hurting for money. Anyway, that's my two cents. Thanks a lot. Bye.